Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It has been such an active week with weather. We have had one system bring so much severe weather to the central and southern plains. This has been a several day um, event and it is still continuing. Here are some pictures of the damage you all can see. This was a road or was a road and it's been washed out by a huge mudslide and there's now a car sticking in it and then a confirmed tornado touches down near Henry County, Texas right near Highway 79 near, near Sulphur Wells Academy Road and it left massive damage. You all can see this was a well-built house completely demolished. Here's another house that was really, really, really bad, uh, really, really, really bad uh, hard hit by this tornado. Here's another one. I think that's the exact same one. Excuse me for putting that on. But this is our system now. It has combined with another area of low pressure here in the North Atlantic. And we're still seeing severe weather all throughout the central and southern plains, working throughout the Ohio River Valley, and then now even getting up into New England. This is a massive system formed by two areas of low pressure. Uh, three, uh, excuse me, two warm fronts and two cold fronts. And please be sure if you have not already clicked the subscribe button. Uh, my big goal now is 150 subscribers by June 1st. That was my original goal, 150 subscribers by June 21st. And I am now at 117. So thank you to everybody who is currently subscribed. You guys are what keeps me on my feet, getting in front of the camera and bringing you all a, ma uh, a really great broadcast. So once again, please be sure to hit the subscribe button to help me reach that goal. And just so that way you would know, all the graphics during this broadcast are provided by the Weather Channel. So here's a current look at our radar, at our radar as of 5.20 p.m. Central Time. There's really a lot of scattered showers out there. Nothing really severe at this point, which is a very good thing. We had a couple of tornadoes throughout the past couple of days in uh, places like Amarillo, getting up to Oklahoma City. And then also last night, if you watched uh, the Hurricane and I's, uh, the Hurricane H2 and I's live stream, we were live streaming on a massive tornado outbreak in southwestern Texas. We had over several, well, we had over five supercells next to each other with very strong rotation. And this system is not anywhere close to being over. So here's your chance of seeing severe thunderstorms throughout uh, the rest of today and then also going into tonight. Basically, in the exact same area where the front is currently located going from uh, east from going from northeastern Texas all the way throughout the central uh, Mississippi River Valley going all the way throughout the Ohio River Valley and then eventually getting into New England places like Pittsburgh Baltimore and New York City so here's how much rain we're forecasting through the, uh, through the throughout the rest of our day today really not that rain really not that much rain maybe up to an inch or so in a couple of space in a couple of places like Shreveport going into Nashville Pittsburgh and also into Philadelphia so not a big washout. However, the rain is not really going to be the big, you know, uh, story for the system. It's really going to be the severe weather and also the wind. So here's your 10-day forecast for our local area. Shout out to my partner, Will, for making this graphic for me. So a gorgeous day for us um, to end the week and then also to start the weekend. Temperatures, we're going to be, uh, we're going to be uh, ex experiencing a cold front as the system works its way through our area. So we are going to go from 81 on Saturday down to 70 on uh excuse me 81 on friday down to 70 on saturday and then we will finally warm back up into the high 70s as you get into sunday and then however we're going to have a front come through that will bring us a 50 percent chance of scattered thunderstorms but we will, but we will warm up back up to 81 and then we have another warm front coming through um that will bring us down that will bring us up to 84 but a couple of rainy days until we can really got finally get to the end of the week next week and then eventually into the weekend and that's where we will end off with sunshine. So here's some upcoming announcements for my channel, what's going on. Um, daily broadcast will be uploaded before 6 p.m. every single day unless I have something going on. And then I will post that in my, uh, in my announcement on my website for all the latest details. And my website will be uh, uploaded, my, video, my website will be updated before 5 p.m. every single day. So once again, it is so crucial that you all are checking into my website at least once a day because I post probably three to four announcements on my homepage every single day telling you what is going on, where my videos are, what time I'll be uploading them, and what they're going to be on. So it is very, very crucial that you're checking in on that website. And here it is right here, liamsweather.org. That is my website. And please be sure if you're not already following me on social media, I am on Twitter at liamsweather621, obviously on YouTube at liamsweather. And then I'm also on Facebook at Liam Kenny. And then once again, please be sure to hit that subscribe button so you can help me reach my goal of 150 subscribers by June 1st. So that is all I have for you all today. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.